Well, if you've watched any of our severe weather coverage in the past, you may have noticed that we sometimes talk about different colored polygons that our radar computer can pop up now. So I want to just kind of break some of those down in case any of these tornado warnings get issued. You know what we're showing on the radar. So this one right here. Also, I want to make note this is uh, uh, this radar image is from earlier in May. This is from the severe weather event that we had on May 8th. This is not current. So back on May 8th, our radar computer was popping up that red tornado polygon, and that means that that tornado warning was issued because of radar indicated rotation. That's what we had for several years, just those red polygons. Well, recently our computers have updated and now we can bring in a couple of different colors too. So whenever we get one of those purple polygons that pop up, it's a little bit difficult to see, but this is the radar image also from May 8th. This is from that tornado that moved through Columbia and we had that purple polygon on there and that lets us know when that tornado warning uh, polygon turns purple. That is a confirmed tornado. So somebody has seen that, called that into the National Weather Service or when we look at the debris on the radar, we can tell that there is a debris signature with that tornado that's popping up on the radar as well. So either somebody confirmed it or the radar is confirming it with debris that's being lofted up in the air. Once that tornado polygon turns pink, that means it is a tornado emergency. Those are issued pretty rarely. We actually had one of those that was just issued. That's the tornado that we've been talking about just north of our viewing area that was on the ground for several, several miles and several hours too. Fortunately, that stayed just to the north of our viewing area, but that's what that purple polygon means a tornado emergency. When it comes to severe thunderstorm warnings, we also had different colored polygons of those as well. Our typical ones that you're going to see are these yellow ones. That's what we've already had tonight. That's for severe uh, for winds going around 60, uh, 58 miles an hour to 70 miles an hour and uh, also golf ball sized hail that's going to be possible with some of those severe thunderstorms. And then as we head on, uh, if those storms get a little bit stronger, they're going to pop up an orange polygon color and with those those are the destructive severe thunderstorm warnings. Uh, those are issued for winds gusting up to 80 miles per hour or higher and also baseball sized hail with those orange polygons. Again, those are the destructive severe thunderstorm warnings.